Hello and welcome to the QGIS or QGIS exercise 5. Um, in this exercise what we'll do is we'll work with the topology and um, azimuth and distance plugins. Um, this is important if you're trying to just um, check topology on something or if you're going ahead and you're um, you know want to want to cogo something out or map something out. So um, the first thing you'll want to do is you'll want to actually open up QGIS uh, 2.6 and then what you want to do is go ahead and add um, a layer and in the exercise 5 folder you'll want to add the parcels. So the parcels should look like this. What you'll want to do too is you'll want to go to manage and install plugins under the plugins and here you'll get a couple and on this example you'll get errors because of our firewall here at the tax commission. Um, but uh, as you can see um, what you want to do is type in topo topology you want to install the topology checker which installs the topology checker right here and then what you'll want to do is go ahead and just type in azimuth and then you'll want to install the azimuth and distance plugin. I've got the calculator too you don't need the calculator um, if you want to test or try that out you can do that but um, the azimuth and distance plugin is what we'll be using here. So you just click on that and then click close and like I said the topology checkers here and um, the or excuse me the the um, the azimuth and distance plugin are under topolo topo topo topography sorry topography on the um, on the plugins many of the topology checkers right here. So what you'll want to do is click on that uh, box there and then what we'll want to do is it'll pop this this box up here you'll go to configure here and you want to select parcels for the layer and then for the rules must not have duplicates and then you want to select parcels here and then must not have gaps and you could set tolerances too if you wanted to um, these are the two rules that we're going to do but you could do all kinds of stuff I mean you could do um, must not have any overlaps with you know certain other layers um, but we're, we're just going to do this basic here so just hit OK and then what you want to do is make sure that you check the box that says show errors at the bottom and then you'll just hit validate all that'll run through it and all the ones that are in red are all the errors um, so that pretty much concludes the topology checker. Um, the next portion of this lecture will be the azimuth and distance plugin, and that'll be in a separate video.